Your discretion is advised. Okay, that's new. What what are you watching? Mm. Star Wars as blue text. <laughs> Wait, why did we get that <laughs> warning? <laughs> oh, oh, mysterious. This is like what? Episode what? And you get five. this warning now? <laughs> it's on episode five too. <laughs> What's happening with fives? <laughs> I promise we're fine. More like, is the show fine? Mmm, <laughs> good for you, man. It's good to have a healthy body. And a new healthy look! You look like a guy who could go solo camping. You look- <laughs> You look like a Yu-Gi-Oh character. With your collar up and like that. Where do people get such jackets that have enormous collars like this? I want one just to look, like, this stupid. <laughs> You can turn any of your shirt like that. You just gotta like yeah, iron it with like that stuff that you spray on you when you iron your clothes to make it all crispy. Enamel? No! <laughs> Stop with the enamel. Alright. He's trying to make friends. Okay, I get it. He's trying to make normal friends. In this episode, who's going to be lonely and think about killing themselves? <laughs> because we got that warning. What's up with that, man? Yeah. We didn't get that in like the previous war. Must be serious. But why'd y'all have to meet up at night, though? Yeah, right? Did can, I miss can, something? Can Japan stop doing weird behaviors? <laughs> <laughs> My name is College Man. Wait, what club is this? I completely missed. President of Shore? Aww. Oh, I think it's a traveling club. Bro, he's gonna go solo camping. Is that why they're doing this at night? Or early morning so they could leave early? Yeah, probably. Like, ah, we found a place to go. Let's go this way. We need real spirits. When they were talking about his friend got involved, I thought like he accidentally like got someone killed. Yeah, but like, oh, you met this girl. She isn't dead. She's just, her hands are fuzzy. Her hands all fuzzy and she's a yandere for getting scared and is trying to gaslight this guy into it. <laughs> he has to go through the pain. Why doesn't she have to? Maybe she loves it. <laughs> Maybe she loves that pain of nerves on your hands. <laughs> Oh my god! Wait, did she give him those glasses so she could spy on him? Yes. <laughs> Does he know that his glasses have nanotech to spy from cameras? Spy family ass technology. They actually sell those in like spy shops for uh, anyone to buy. Glasses to record uh -huh. and stream from? Yep. That would be useful for just like a real life Twitch stream. <laughs> Your friends adore me! <laughs> I want to make my own friends, damn it! You go, man. Go on in for attempting the steps. Will anyone reciprocate, though? I know, I feel like that guy who just introduced himself is like, Oh, you want to make friends? Well, good luck on that, bye. <laughs> like, dang, dude, you couldn't be like, Well, I guess I could be your first friend? Yeah. Are you spying on him? A sick move. Dude, she's got all kinds of, like, data on him. What the hell? Even phone number. <laughs> Oh my god. I must stalk him. Woman. It's probably that huge thing on like the right of the glasses. <laughs> for real. This is bad. That's really bad even for you. <laughs> uh, but still. I still don't approve. Uh oh. Wow, it even picks up bad juju. Oh my god, girl. <laughs> please. Well, because that's unhealthy. This looks terrible on most people who look at this. Both of you! She's just doing that because she's like, oh, I'm getting like vibes of bad juju. I love it. Yayo at least wants the potential to get some really bad spirit to feed to her other collection. She's just wanting to stalk him to get the thrill of it. You're right. She can't see the ghost, so she's not getting any ghost vibes. So what's the point of just stalking the guy? Yeah. Oh. We have to see how he does and make a new cringe compilation out of it. Wow, these... You, have, you two you, are terrible. He really does need new friends. Yeah, that's why he wanted anyone that isn't these two. Surprisingly that his hair doesn't get in the way of the camera. I like when anime hair just phases through people's eyes. Yeah, she knows him well. Narrating like you're on a Japanese game show. He did it! He went for two. That's a good thing. You look like an Akira. <laughs> you, you look lame. So is this your first time coming here? Would be a so, you're a college freshman. 
Why are you all like on edge? Everyone's first meeting also that's just Japan behavior. True. Where they're like, well, if I say too much, what if I annoy the other guy? Yep. Yep. You gotta pre-program responses in conversation. If you do it at first, since you're little, it, it's come natural to you. But if you're not used to it, you're like this guy. I have like a very vague sentence of if someone just talks to me about a subject, I'll just say, subject is quite a thing, haha. <laughs> and it works as a response depending on the vibe that was just talked about. <laughs> like there was a family who was talking to me getting my hair cut the other day. Some lady was like, oh yeah, I had to grow my hair out. It's kind of a problem. And I'm like, yeah, hair's quite a thing, haha. <laughs> And she's like, yeah, <laughs> just say X is a thing. But that means that you won't last your conversation because you didn't ask when, why, why how about you? Because you're not asking for the next ball to be thrown. You just kind of ended the ball. Oh, I mean, she, You she, literally dropped the ball. Well, no, she attempted to start talking to me anyway. So hypothetically, I wanted to continue, I could have. But also, I'm getting my hair cut. Shut up. <laughs> I mean, what you're doing is how to end a conversation. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Was it earlier that the girls were getting like weird vibes on this guy? It, there was a dude going die. Uh oh, he opened his eyes. Or oh. I. So there's a story about a guy who died in hypothetically my car. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, now I understand. Wow, that's... Why? Why? Don't think that's the Kool-Aid you want. I know this Seiyu. He's one of my favorite sound. Mm -hmm. If I'm not mistaken, it is Jonathan from JoJo. Oh, oh, poor Jonathan talking about killing each other. But he's never around when they get there. Ah, he does it. How do we know you're not him? <laughs> yeah, right. You got the hair silhouette. What? <laughs> we only share the same name. It's nothing personal. I know, just like... Oh, shit. Oh, no! You are getting kill yourself vibes. Oh, no. He's possessed. Die yourself right now. Oh, no! You, you drunk him! See, this is why you should watch your drink. You get roofied. Holy crap, the whole bus. The whole car. The whole... You're fucked. This is not a bus clap moment. This is a bus knife themselves moment. Wait, you guys should be able to see what he can't see because it's on the glasses. Yeah. The one time you got lucky that you were, like, spying on him. But I do not condone anyone spying <laughs> on people. <laughs> For the rest of this, though, it's still pretty bad. Oh, God, this building. Ugh. Why? Why kidnap him? Is this all a ruse just to, like, find a bunch of college kid and just to beat them up? That or just come on. Just the, the woes of life get you down. You We need a killing. Oh, shoot. This is an elaborate setup for suicide. I don't think this is quite suicide. Wait, the whole group? The whole freaking group is here to commit seppuku? No, we're not here for this! Japan ghost, nah. Oh. There must have been a man in the past who really hated their life. What if it wasn't a seppuku and they were all murdered? Mm. Make it look like a seppuku. Why you gotta be T? Why, why is it T? Well, there's an M and there's a T. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Because he's a murderer? Either kill her or feel bad because I hated my life, other people should die with me. One of those two. If he's struggling, he's gonna like fall and choke himself. Just bust it open! Skinny hands! Thank God for small. Oh, only old doors. Call the cops, man! Mm. Can you untie those people first? I think the rest of them were dead. Untie them, they could be still saved. Lift. Oh no. Oh, is it sake? Gold flake sake. Oh jeez. Drink the Kool-Aid, oh, you gonna, motherfucker. You're gonna drown, you're gonna drown the ghost? Oh. 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 Um. Um. He's still got that mad energy. Um. 
Dude, they're sucking, man. What are you doing? No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What a nice clothes. Oh. <laughs> he has kill energy to begin with. You're just a bad person. Now call the cops! Oh. <laughs> Let them deal with the human being! <laughs> yeah, glass bottles do that. Ah. Oh, I hate his face. Well, yeah. Maybe you shouldn't have done something wrong in the first place. Yeah, right. <laughs> she like hog tie him or something? If you're gonna kill yourself, make it your own decision, damn it. Please don't actually do that. That's bad advice. Don't drag anyone to any bad ideas you have, basically. <laughs> yeah. So those people are okay, right? What the heck? Wait, it's still there? Uh. Oh, what the heck? I must drag this Wait, man. Wait, did she do that on purpose to let him do it by himself? Maybe there's something done with rope. Did you guys seriously just leave those guys there with a rope? Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh. Eventually they super die. この世にとどまろうとする奴がいる。そこで行われるのが他の霊を食べてエネルギーを増やすこと。ああ。食われた方は死ななあ。ああ。They oh. oh. become endless food. Why did you let him? To grow more of them? He's growing them like trees. Oh. What an what an elaborate This little girl, she just allowed someone to get killed. Yeah, I mean apparently the guy already sucked, but Yeah. Did she already grab it? Yeah, she said she got a spirit that consumed a hundred souls. Oh. oh my god, they're not dead. So there's only one that died. He's gonna be like, wait a minute, how did you know where I was? I thought normally hanging yourself kind of kills you pretty quick. It chokes you, unless you break your neck, it doesn't insta-kill you. That's what I was saying, is like, cut them down immediately, so that way, you know, you could still revive them. True. You need a crowbar right now, like I do. <laughs> give, give him a crowbar. Learn how to use that hand. Maybe it's got power. Gross your spirits out by rubbing your nerves on them. Seriously, so he's not gonna question how they found you? Why did he just say that? <laughs> and she responded. <laughs> She's like a third grader. Just... This girl is just freaking dangerous in all kinds of levels. D yes. <laughs> oh my god, he believed it. Oh my god. I think you're more in danger with these girls. Than you are like any spirit that could <laughs> enter your life. <laughs> Oh my god. I mean, the entire start of this episode, end of last was, oh, I'm going to super stalk him and just see what he's up to, see if he fucks up at his college meetings. <laughs> this poor guy. I think his luck is just not there. No. No, he's not. <laughs> he couldn't even make friends. They all just try to, like, off themselves. Wow. <laughs> no luck for this guy. He's stuck with these two. 